And what kind of a day will this be? A day like all days in the mothball fleet. Check the gate. Right. Nothing changes. Nothing ever changes. Empty ships out of date. Check the watermark. Right. Check the lines. Uh -huh. Brother, eight months of this is enough. I want out. Mr. Liggett. Yes? Your order, sir. Oh, thank you. Will there be anything else, sir? Oh, no, 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 thank you, that's all. Is? Of course, dear. Missiles. Guided missiles. Finally. After all these months. Wonderful. Simply wonderful. Dan? Yeah? What are missiles? I mean, really? Gentlemen, gunpowder first extended the reach of weapons beyond the strength of a man's arm. Aircraft further extended the reach of naval weapons beyond that of a ship's guns. Missiles are further extending our naval military capability. This class will be particularly concerned with surface-to-air guided missiles. These weapons are most effective because they can change their direction in flight. No matter how much the aircraft may bob and weave, the missile will seek out and destroy it. These systems are very effective in extending the capabilities of our fleets at sea maintaining freedom of the seas in peacetime and control of the seas for our own purposes in time of war. Gentlemen, you will be working with automatic systems. You will be able to fight by merely pushing a button. Firepower is the word at Dam Neck. It's like a big engineering college on this lonely strip of beach in Virginia with just one thing on its mind the theory and practice of finding targets and hitting them. Our missile course is 10 weeks long. 10 weeks. The reading alone is enough for a year. The 
instructors are in a hurry. All in all, a very solid course. We cover both the missiles and the systems for guiding them home. This is beautiful equipment to work with. Instantly responsive. Practically foolproof. Get a kick out of running it. Davis, 85.1. Good enough. Hawes, 71.8. Well. Jackson, 91.3. Hey, that's not bad. Kingsbury, 76.9. Made it. Liggett, 97.6. 97.6. Lorimer, 77.2. McLaren, 86.5. That's a very awkward procedure, Mr. Francini. Sir? The men, they don't work smoothly. <laughs> they can't, really. They're new men, sir. Good, but new. There are always new men. Even with new men, you can still depend on the equipment. That is, if you keep on top of things. Well, Mr. Francini, you've been doing well the past few weeks. Yes, sir. System's been working perfectly. I hope the system can keep it up. If you have any suggestions for improving it, I'd like to hear about them. 
Mr. Liggett, please dial 214. Come in. Yes, Mr. Liggett. Sit down, please. Thank you, sir. Your department's been right on schedule with a good performance during the ship's exercise. Thank you, sir. However, the proficiency reports on the men in your division have not been very good. I know that, sir. I'm sure they'll improve. I've been chiefly concerned with operational performance. Understand me clearly, Mr. Leggett. Machines and electrons can help a great deal. But they're useless without a good crew. That's all. Thank you, sir. Canada expects to tie up in Norfolk at 18.30. Liberty will commence for sections one and two at 18.45. be a little shorthanded next week. Oh? Cooper, emergency leave. Just come in. Which one is Cooper? First class in the after magazine. He runs a control panel. Do you have someone to replace him? Bergman knows the panel pretty well. Pretty well. We are joining a task force next week, Mr. Franchini. Yes, sir. And we've got to depend on a man who knows his job just pretty well. We'll get by, sir. We'd better. If the system were completely mechanized, I wouldn't have to put up with things like this. These old Navy hands is they hate new ideas. They don't want to think about them. But, darling, it's hard to change. They simply won't face the fact that men are becoming obsolete. Oh, dear, I hope not. Hmm? <laughs> no, I mean the emphasis today. It's more and more on machines, less and less on manpower. <sighs> Automation. But you'll always have to have people around to start things and stop them. Oh, sure. A few. Dan, why did that man have to go? Huh? What was his name? Uh, Cooper. Why did he have to take emergency leave? I don't know. I forgot to ask. Oh, Dan. Oh, Dan. Understand me clearly, Mr. Leggett. You will be able to fight. Push a button. Push a button. Franchini! Cooper! Franchini! Do you hear me? This is Mr. Leggett!
on report. Every one of them. Understand me clearly, Mr. Leggett. You will be able to fight by merely pushing a button. Somebody! Where are they? It's got to be someone. Beautiful equipment. Wait a minute. I'll find them. Hello! Hello, answer me! Anyone! Answer me! There's just got to be a crew. This ship's useless. No good without a crew. Damn, what's the matter? An air defense exercise, so we'll be in the spotlight. The launcher crew will be running dummies up each time. Any questions? But, sir, why bother running them up? The Admiral's 30 miles away. Because the important thing is to give each man training in his job. Sometimes we overlook this. We forget who wins the battles. How is the Admiral? <laughs> mean, they tell me. <laughs>
sir. The Canberra has just moved into position. Very well. Well? Sir, we have not yet alerted the missile ships about using warheads today. That's right. Shall I pass the word now, sir? No, I'll tell you when. Romeo 5 at 030. Assign Director 10 to Romeo 5. Director 10 is assigned, sir. Launcher 1 ready? Launcher 1 ready, sir. Assign Launcher 1. Looks good. Coming in fine. All right. Simulate fire. that range, we'd have a splash right now. Pass the word. Bridge weapons, splash Romeo 5. Check combat for any more bogeys in the area. Canberra reports, splash Romeo 5. Splash indeed, sounds like we're playing games. It's our 14th so far. How about our big drones? Are coming in now? Yes, sir. In whose sector? Canberra, sir. Fine. Tell Canberra to take it with a warhead. Let's see if they really can shoot. Bogey Delta 2 closing fast, check negatives. Aye. Flag flap combat, Delta 2 closing fast. Warheads, Franchini. How long will it take? If they're bringing the dummies down now, this has to be done manually. I know. About another 45 seconds, sir. Look. It's coming in fast, sir. You're not kidding. It's tight. Hi, sir. Systemize, this is Delta. Warning red. One's for real. Fire. The last missile shot was a warhead. Radar reports a direct hit. Now secure from General Quarters. I guess some things you have to learn the hard way.
man, uh, curious about saying that uh, we're going to be going to uh, Haiti next week. Well, let's get the law. All engines ahead, full. All engines ahead, full. Indicate 180 RPM. Indicate 180 RPM. 